The Central Missouri Jennies are looking to punch their ticket to the MIAA Tournament Finals, facing the number one seed Central Oklahoma in Game 2 of the Tournament Semifinals. Second inning, two on for the Broncos. Paige Peepfish gets Amelia Huggins to strike out swinging for out number three. It's scoreless, heading into the Jennies' half of the frame. Renla McCoy doubles to the gap in left center. That drives home Mackenzie McAtee and Jessica Sater. Central Missouri leading 2-0 at the end of two complete. Jen still up two, heading into the sixth. Central Oaks' Hazel Pimple at the plate. It's a two-run home run to right. That ties it up at two. This game heads into extras still knotted at two. Top of the eighth with two on for UCO. Lexi Dobson trying to put the Broncos ahead, but Aubrey McRoberts there with a sliding catch to get out of the inning. Bottom half of the frame, Ashlyn Cook leading off, connects on the first pitch she sees. Right fielder misjudges the base hit single, allows the ball to travel all the way to the fence. Cook turns on the Jets and scores on an in-the-park home run for the Jennies. Central Missouri is headed to the championship game in walk-off fashion, defeating number 14 ranked Central Oklahoma 3-2. I honestly thought she was going to try to make a diving catch and I wouldn't even get on base. So when I saw the ball went under her glove, that's a tricky spot where you can get pretty far. So um, when I was rounding third, my coach was holding me. I thought they had made the cut, but as they turned around, it had gone through. So I knew I had a shot at four. Oh, uh, this is, it just feels so big. Um, our team is so good. I know that even if I, I was struggling in the beginning of the day, I knew even if I'm struggling, they're here to pick me up and um, my team's just there for me.